OK, let's say you want to create a new discussion forum. For example, you want a specific forum for a particular type of discussion, or you want to keep the same course or classroom, but your students have changed. You've had a lot of student turnover, and you don't want them to be distracted by old conversations. So you want to create a new discussion forum. That's very easy. Up here, turn editing on and you'll get all of your editing widgets. Then you go to the section you're interested in, and I'm interested in speaking and writing here. Now, if students are going to be reading and writing particularly, it's something they're going to be active in, so it's an activity. Under here, in this list, you'll find Forum. Click on it, and you'll have your editing options. I'm going to call this Let's Talk, and you have various types of forum, single discussions, one person, one discussion, question and answer, or just general standard forums. I'll leave it as that, because that's really the most flexible. Here under introduction, you have to say something. This is where you can define the rules for how people behave in the forum. So I'm going to say, um, be nice and no flaming. OK, but you could say anything you like. Under force anyone to be subscribed, I'm going to say yes initially, because I want everyone to know initially whether something's been posted here. If they want to unsubscribe later, they can. Read tracking, for the same reason, I'm going to say on, so that when people log into the classroom, they will see one new post, three new posts attached to this email or this forum. And under maximum attachment size, I'm going to choose course upload limit, just so people are as flexible as possible. I'm also going to say that they can subscribe via RSS, and I'm going to set the number of posts per day at five. I'm not going to worry about anything else, and I'm just going to say save and display. Here I see the basic outline of my discussion forum, but there's of course no discussion. So if I click here, I can add a discussion topic, and I can say here, welcome, and in the box here, say whatever I like. For example, welcome to the new discussion forum. Say what you like. I can format this however I like. I can change the size. You know, you can do all of the usual things. I can even add smileys if I like. And I can add links or pictures or whatever. Down here at the bottom, I can choose how I want to receive notification and if something is really urgent I can tick here and as soon as I press post a forum it will be emailed to anyone who subscribes to this classroom okay I don't normally have to do this because half an hour after I've put a post up it'll get emailed out anyway and that half an hour gives me time to edit it if need be so I'm going to leave it as is post and here it gives me my news and as that's how I've got my browser set, I'll say allow. And here we can see it. OK, so if I go back to our classroom and I go down, I will find Let's Talk. And if I click here, there is my discussion. It's as easy as that. Hope you have fun creating discussion forums. Happy moodling.